Hey, I'm Chuck Dransfield, and I am at the gravesite of George Burns and Gracie Allen. In my opinion, soulmates, and one of the all-time great love stories. Uh, George wrote a book about Gracie that was a major bestseller uh, in the late 1980s. And he told the story of how, you know, they of course started out as a man-woman act in vaudeville. And they, they had some moderate success and they started to grow in momentum and they started to become recognized. But it was platonic in the beginning because Gracie was in love with another man. And it was looking close to where these two were going to get married. George had fallen deeply in love and great with Gracie. And it was just before Christmas of 1926, he said to Gracie, I can't go on like this. I can't keep working with you. We're going to have to break up the act because I, I, I love you. And I, I can't bear the thought of you seeing that other man. Well, George got a phone call from Gracie Christmas night. And Gracie said that she had been crying all day long. And she realized that, they, that she must surely love George also. And she said, it's because if somebody can make me cry that much, it has to be because I love him. They were married soon afterwards. And that's when their career really took off. <laughs> they, they had a top of the mountain show business career in vaudeville, movies, they triumphed in radio, and then of course finally television before Gracie retired. Um, this has been Chuck Transfield. I would thank you if you would please like and subscribe to my channel, Chuck's Captivating Chronicles.